Are we live? Are we live? Yep. Hey guys, what's up? A very, very warm welcome to all of you. I hope all you guys are having a very good day going on. Now you can see I am very excited because I am back here at 9 p.m. with an amazing, amazing topic. Now this topic has been, uh, you know, uh, confusing a lot of you guys. So I thought, what if I come and clarify this concept in today's class, guys? So quickly tell me, are you all ready for this amazing session? Give me a quick yes in the chat box. Are you all ready? Hi, Simi. Hi, Isha. Hi, Shristi. Hi, Alone Boy. <laughs> Hi, Rahul. Hi, Trishna. Good, good, good. Very warm welcome, guys. If you guys are new here, a very warm welcome to my class. My name is Mohan, Master Teacher of Science from Vedantu. And if you are new to Vedantu, Young Wonders, do not forget to hit that subscribe button right away because you will get so many other amazing topics, amazing videos in this channel. Pro Gamers. Hi, what's up? What's up? I took your name. Hi, Anya. Hello. Hi, Srinu. Hi, hi, hi. Big hi to all of you. Big, big hi. And advance happy birthday, guys. <laughs> advance happy Diwali, guys. <laughs> I saw somebody's word in the chat box. Advance happy Diwali. <laughs> hi, Andrea. Hi, Ko. Uh, okay. Mm -mm. Sir, were you sleeping? No, I was taking continuous classes. Do I look like I was sleeping? Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. So guys, let us see what exactly is this topic all about. So guys, today's session or today's video is all about what are these test tube babies? Test tube babies? So what exactly are they are going to be what we'll be learning right today in today's session, guys. So with that, call up all of your friends and click on the like button right away. I, sh I should see at least 50 likes before we start this class. Only if we see 50 likes, we'll be able to start. Come on, come on, everybody, quick. 50 likes hona zaruri hai 50 likes hi rahul hi pravanesh big fan i am your big ac da hi okay cool cool <laughs> all right let's go forward if you guys are on instagram do not forget to follow me on instagram my instagram handle is learn underscore with underscore mohan do follow me over there hit me up send me your doubts uh, see what is happening see what are all the new videos coming up you should definitely follow me if you have Instagram. If you don't have Instagram, it's okay. Follow me on YouTube. Okay. <laughs> All right. Cool then. So we'll go forward, guys. So what exactly are test tube babies? Now, before we understand what are test tube babies, we all have to understand how does a sexual reproduction happen when we talk about humans. We should understand the basics of that and then we should focus on how test tube babies are formed. Okay. Great. Again, this topic is a part of your 8th grade uh, uh, reproduction in animals also. So make sure that you guys focus and listen carefully to understand this topic very easily. All right. <clears throat> Hi, sir. Do you know me? You didn't invite me to your office for eating. Come, come, come. In I'll invite you to my house. Come. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Which class is this? This class is for everybody. For everybody. All right. Let us learn about this very simply. So first, we all have to understand the basics, I told, right? So what exactly is the basics? So this topic comes under one main important topic that is your, your reproduction, right? Now, when we talk about reproduction, there are two types of reproduction. One is your asexual reproduction. And the other one is your sexual reproduction. So we will be specifically talking about sexual reproduction only. Okay. Now under sexual reproduction, generally, how does this happen? Okay. In sexual reproduction, you need two individuals or two parents. One is your male or the father. And the other one is your female or the mother. Right? Exactly. You need two things. One is a male, other one is a female or father and mother. So in sexual reproduction, the fusion of gametes happen. What does this gamete mean? From the male, we take one cell. From the female, we take one cell. Both the cells fuse together. 
all right fusion happens so from the male we have the male reproductive system right in the male reproductive system we have the male gamete that is your sperms in the female we have our female gamete that is your egg or the ova okay now what happens these two are your gametes what are they gametes male gamete and female gamete all right now what should happen fusion should happen so the two cells the two cells this diagram is just for reference now <laughs> big Be becomes one single cell what is this process called this fusion that happens here is nothing but fertilization the fusion of male gamete and the female gamete is called as fertilization now where does this happen in the human body remember very carefully sorry uh, listen very carefully the fertilization happens in the female in the fallopian tube or oviduct in the fallopian tube or in the oviduct that is where your fertilization happen since the fertilization happens inside the body of the human being it is called as internal fertilization what is it called internal fertilization because it is happening inside the oviduct inside the female's body so this this basics you guys are clear about it after fusion we have the zygote the zygote then becomes into your embryo then yes fetus baby everything happens after that this is what exactly happens in reproduction be it plants be it animals in sexual reproduction you have two gametes fuse together to form zygote zygote becomes into embryo zygote is a single cell guys so all of our life starts with a single cell how amazing right all of our life we were just a small single cell that cell starts to multiply 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 becomes a bunch of cells then we have the entire human being how amazing is that okay zygote is a single cell guys after fusion a single cell is formed that is zygote got it but wait a minute now that we know where the fertilization happens we know the sperm has to meet with the egg that is a very important process right the sperm has to meet with the egg but some cases in some cases this fusion is not able to happen inside the female's body maybe many number of reasons maybe the oviduct is blocked maybe the sperm is not able to reach the egg or the fusion is not able to happen inside the oviduct the fertilization is not successful inside the female's body in that cases it's a very sad thing right what do they do in that cases if a couple wants a baby in that cases what do they go for that is the case where they go for test tube babies or in vitro fertilization yes let us see what that is that is what we'll be learning right now guys that is all about the test tube babies let's see what exactly is this got it yes where is it cool now when we talk about test tube babies in fact the baby is developed inside the test tube that is why they called as test tube babies all right now test tube baby is a term that refers to a child that is conceived outside the women's body so here the fertilization is not happening inside the oviduct the fertilization is happening outside the female's body so can we call it as external fertilization can we call it as external fertilization why not because it's not happening inside the female's body right it's happening externally where is it happening in a in a, in a petri dish or in a test tube in a test tube <laughs> how amazing science is right that is also called as in vitro fertilization or ivf 
IVF. How do they do it? The doctors will take the sperm from the father. The doctors will take the egg from the mother. They will fuse this both in a test tube outside the body. One, one cell from there, one cell from here, fuse them both together. And once the zygote and um, this uh, baby is developed, they again take it and put it inside the female's body. How amazing, right? Let's talk about the entire process. The entire process is definitely done in a laboratory. It's done in a lab. Okay. Now let's see the process. First, in this process, the egg is taken from the mother's ovary and it is fertilized by the sperms of the father. So we take the sperms of the father, we take the egg of the mother, we fertilize it outside the body. Okay. The fertilized egg is cultured for two to six days. They take care of it in a petri dish. They look after it. They make sure that it is multiplying. Right? It is allowed to divide two to four times inside the test tube itself. The zygote is multiplying right now into a group of cells in a test tube. These eggs are then taken and returned back into the mother's uterus. After that, again, normal process. Only the fertilization happens outside. The development of the zygote happens inside the female's body itself. That is in your uterus. Where it can be developed normally. And that is done with the intention to establish a successful pregnancy. How amazing is science? Isn't it? Exactly. So you can see this is how the entire female reproductive system looks like. Alright. You have the ovary. You have the uterus. You can see. This, this is the embryo which is developed in the petri dish. They take it and the doctors will place it inside the uterus. In the uterus, the baby will normally develop. All right. So what is fertilization? Better fertilization is male gamete and female gamete fusing together. Two cells are mixing together. Nuclear fusion is happening. That is your fertilization. Got it. Beautiful. <laughs> and a cute baby is developed after that. So the first test tube baby ever born was Louisi. Meet Louisi, the world's first test tube arrival. It was a super babe. <laughs> this was the newspaper cutting. Right? So, and here is the lovely Louisi. Right now she is like this. So she was the first ever test tube baby. All right. Amazing guys. So that is all about test tube babies. I hope you guys understood how everything happens. Oh, but just remember, you normally the fertilization happens inside the female body. It is internal fertilization. The fertilization happens outside the body. It is external fertilization. In this case, it is in vitro fertilization. Kyunki, the fertilization is happening in a test tube. Got it people. Now that was the amazing topic which you guys all learned today. I know it was amazing. We will definitely meet up in the next video. I hope all of you had fun. Until then, guys, all of you have a very, very safe Diwali. Take care of yourself. Be very safe. Try to not burst crackers. Even if you do, only a little bit. All right. So wear proper, you know, safety uh, measures and everything and burst the crackers. It was amazing teaching you all. Does the test tube baby normal baby have any difference? No, guys. Nothing. Only the fertilization happens outside. The test tube baby or the normal baby, both are babies. They're all normal. Normal human beings. Okay? Alright, so I'll see you all in the next class. So until then, this is me, Mohan, signing off. All of you, take care, stay safe, stay as lovely as always you guys are. Have a good night and a happy Diwali, guys. Bye-bye.